Hi everybody, this is my Xerox VersaLink C405 multifunction laser printer. And uh, today I'm going to show you how to uh, reset the admin password if you received it and, it, uh, and the password's been set to something you don't know, as uh, has happened to me when I purchased this. So uh, before we get started, just a uh, word of warning uh, that uh, I hold no liability or responsibility if you do this outside of your jurisdiction and uh, you get in trouble by your boss because you tried to modify the printer so you could print in color or whatever. So yeah, definitely always make sure that uh, you're doing stuff like this legally and above board and uh, that if this is not your printer that the owner and or the IT department knows exactly what you are doing. So without further ado, um, a good first step is to um, try the default passwords, which is could either be 1111 or the serial number in all caps. And uh, if it is not that, then let's proceed to doing a factory reset. So first go ahead and make sure the printer is on and not in sleep. You'll know this by the screen being on. And then uh, to reset it, you just press and hold the home button for um, about 10 seconds. I think it, you, it could be a little bit shorter, but we'll do it for the full 10 just to be sure. So it won't do it until you uh, depress your finger and then it'll ask you for a password. Now this is gonna be different. This is gonna be six, seven, eight, nine. And then it plays a little chime and then we get the menu again and I'm sure you can change the device settings in this menu as well. But if you just wanna go ahead and factory reset everything so you can change the password, you scroll down to, let's go to device resets and then we're going to reset to factory defaults press reset so then it's gonna restart the printer and uh you should be prompted with the uh, initial setup questionnaire all right so this is definitely not an instantaneous process so uh don't worry if uh, it takes at least a few minutes. So it's just a case of going through, like I said, the initial set questionnaire. This, of course, is the startup page that, uh, of course, it starts up with. Um, and like I said, since you did a factory reset, by default, it prints these out. So how we're going to get in to the, uh, to the printer, of course, is go to device, click login up here, and then admin. And then you could try 1111. I'll definitely do that. And then it says it's invalid. So uh, go ahead and go back into admin. And then if you look on your startup page, you'll see um, you'll see that your, your device's serial number. So go ahead and type that in. All right, and once you've typed it in and make sure it's in all caps, that is important you'll get in and then it's gonna ask you to change the password. So it's probably not surprising that you probably don't know your admin password because uh, yeah, it'll tell you to change it. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. I'm just gonna make it one, 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 since that's easy to remember. And uh, I don't really have to worry about anybody coming around here and uh, changing the settings on my printer now. And that is all you need to do. And now the printer is under your control. Thank you very much for watching. And that will be it.